Yeah, it's our down a garage. This is the Mulolu uh, wind turbine. I got 30 mile an hour wind gust. I got dirty wind, which means it's not perfect. So tomorrow I will be buying the Accurite. Um, hold on. That's what I'm buying right there. It's that whole system. And the model number is 615 HD. It's 90 bucks. I think if you ask me the price is right. Again, it's the model 0061. Let's see if I can clarify this a little bit. I'm buying that tomorrow. So I can actually give a difference. Oops, I dropped my light, sorry. Show you a comparison between what I'm making for wattage out of a 600 watt 12 volt grid tie in on this so that uh, that way I can do a comparison and it'll be boom so you can see comparison between the wind speed it's supposed to be 400 watts I of course now <laughs> I'm recording, you know, the Jinx. Jason Brown, you know what I'm set talking about there, brother. The Jinx of, oh, I got the camera going and nothing. There's the, oh, it's making something. Let's see what happens. Yeah, nothing. Whoa, whoa, whoa! And that's not a super lot, but... Oh, damn it. No more wind. See? Well, anyways... Waiting for another grid tie-in so I can have my solar tied in and then the wind. Right now I just got the wind hooked up because it's going to be windy for the next few days so I'm going to try that out and we'll see if I can pause this and when it comes back I'll start recording. Okay, oh, <laughs> did you see that really quick? It just started. I was hoping to get some more in there. There it goes. There it goes. It's very windy out today. Tomorrow, today is 2-13-2014. See, it does, it does work. Not as good as I was expecting. If it was a Missouri wind and solar, that thing would be in the hundreds. All right, at least close to the hundreds with with what I have. Yeah, I get crap. Dirty wind. It's on my roof of my garage. Uh, when I redo my roof on my house, oh, there it goes. I will be mounting that it's a 10 foot pole on the roof of my house which is higher than my garage but I gotta redo my roof first then I'll put that up there well hope you enjoyed that it's a Yulu I'm trashing the name not on purpose Olo Olo What I'm using blurry sorry hope you like that 
I need more power. More power. Oh, it's cranking now. Oh, 34. Hey, I'm, tomorrow's supposed to be 45 mile an hour winds all day. I'm going to leave it hooked up just the way you see it. There it goes. Yeah, that's 19 point, 7 point, 3 point, 2 point. Yeah, exactly. That's not a lot. I'm kind of disappointed in it. <laughs> Because upstairs, that thing has got to be spinning crazy, five, six hundred RPM. Thing's screaming. I can hear it growling. If it was a lower RPM, I, I'm thinking about taking the magnets and putting them closer. Because uh, on those Ulu Chinese wind turbines, there, the magnets are screwed in. So I was thinking about removing the magnets, putting a spacer to bring it closer to the estator. Maybe that might help. Stainless steel, of course. Washers or uh, spacers or I have a uh, stainless steel. Oh, look, it's making power. I do have stainless steel uh, shim stock. So I might, you know, shim it so it's really close to it. I, yeah, I understand cogging and all that, but I'd rather have the cogging, and then, and then I'll put the Raptor blades on it. Not the Raptor, the uh, the Falcon blades. All right, there you go. Thank you.